Hi, I'm Rob Zip and I'm back at PNC Stadium. You might be getting tired of seeing these videos here, but I'm not. Today, the Houston Dynamo Football Club are playing the Nashville Soccer Club. This is an MLS league game. Uh, the Dynamo haven't won in a while, so hopefully they'll win this game. Uh, Nashville's goalkeeper used to be ours. Um, I think we lost him in a draft pick or um, it was like a, I don't remember exactly why he's gone or over there, but Joe Willis is a cool guy. Hopefully we get the ball past him a few times tonight. Uh, it's hot out here, so excuse me. Uh, I'm parked right next to the stadium again. Like here's, here's my car. Um, as, as I'm recording this, I'm 18 subscribers away from 6,000. So if you're watching and you're not subscribed, now is the time. Um, I'm also gonna take a road trip to an open cup match in Kansas City and I need some, uh, I need some help getting there and back. So if you could drop a uh, super thanks, my d PayPal and Venmo and all that stuff is in the description. Anyway, uh, yeah, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm a little reclimped. I'm actually wearing my Hire Me shirt today. So hopefully people here at the Dynamo see this and say, yes, today's the day. We're going to pay, you know, hopefully they'll help, ter help take care of me going to Kansas City. We'll see. But, uh, and you're wondering, hey, what's this blue jersey you're holding? This is a Rangers jersey. I support Celtic, uh, but I got this jersey from a mystery box. And my friend Scott is from Glasgow, Scotland. Scott from Scotland. Shout out to you, bro. Uh, he's actually a Rangers fan. So when you're from Scotland, you're either from Glasgow specifically, you're either a Rangers fan or a Celtic fan. And uh, he's, a, he's a Rangers fan. And I'm not from Scotland at all. I do have some ancestry there, apparently, from the 23 and me, I found out. But regardless, um, yeah, come along and join me on the most epic adventures. So here we are inside of Pitch 25. I just had to walk across the parking lot. And uh, this back part is the it's the official smoking part. So if you want to smoke, you come back here because it is open air. You can actually feel feel the mugginess today. Whew. It's a muggy warm one. Hey, look! It's the Surge Supporters Group. Hey, what's up, Rob? Look at that sick look at that sick shirt, man. Yeah. Woo. Available at. Uh, Spring, your Jesus. spring store, yeah. Sergio, there's the there's the giveaway for today, huh? Yeah, That's pretty awesome. nice. That's pretty nice. Very cool. With the with the little handle, perfect for for waving around during the game. For real. You're not gonna get tired of waving this. Nice. All right. We're gonna leave pitch 25. Dynamo dose are tied with Minnesota United one to one. Houston Astros are down zero to one. Dash are playing it. They're gonna play in about uh, 12 minutes. All right, here we go. Here we go into the stadium. That's where the players park. So they close the bike lane on game days. Kind of, I don't know, what can you do? Smell the sweet smell of those dogwood trees there. All right, we are in the stadium. I have my shirt on. And I actually talked to somebody. I was like, give me a job. Give me a job. Come on. And he said, Zach, just walked by. Just missed him. So it's a Saturday. Every single concession stand is open. Unlike, uh, unlike that Wednesday night. Didn't get here in time to get the flag, but there may be one waiting for me in the seat. We shall see. They gotta up the hoops. Celtic supporter there. We got their private party going on here at the Heineken Star Bar. So some people said that, you know, we want to see more of the stadium. So here you go. I'm walking around the stadium. Hopefully, uh, I'm not getting a copyright notice. Oh, I got to check in. 
Lineups are confirmed. Pat Onstad is going to be signing some autographs. Over there in the autograph alley is where I came in. We already got a long line for food. See the question mark over there? You can go inside there, sign up for the designated driver, and they give you a coupon for a beverage. I got out of line. Herman said, hey, bring it over here. Aquafina is not the best purified drinking water, but it is an entire liter. So if you wait in the longer line, you get a 20 ounce. This one you get a 33.8 ounce. Double hack. It's a double hack. All right. The Hustle Town supporter section. Here we are. Let's see if there's a flag down there for me. I'm going to stand next to uh, Jeff and Sriracha Man today. There's Jake. I was talking to Jake about going to Kansas City. And this guy, Pius. Pius' son is annoying TV. Yeah. How many million subscribers does your son have? I don't like know. But two did you see million. Them? Did you see one of the ones he just sent me? No. -uh. There's El Betion. Somebody said, what? Oh, no. I tell you, I tell you, I tell you. Glenn Challenger, working for the man. Right. Hey, man. We just loaded the smoke bombs. We've got the bag of smoke bombs right there. There, there they are. Because every little thing is gonna be all right, sweet song. They got the MLS flag, the MD Anderson flag, there's Webb, there's the Ukraine flag. today see if they can turn it around starting off pretty good starting off pretty good
making some good movement here. Just going back and forth, back and forth, side to side. Taking the free kick from outside the box here. Let me clear this away again. Oh, he faked it. Papiko with the clearance. Sending it all the way back to Willis. Nashville is kind of more on the front foot right now. Took a short corner. Oh! Come on. Got a corner for Nashville here. Their Nashville free kick outside the box. They're getting too many of these chances. I do not do not like it. This is a pretty good team. You can't keep giving good teams chances. There you go. back and forth and they lost it. Right, Dynamo have a corner here in the 32nd minute of the match. Let's see if they can, can break this opportunity. Crowd's into it. Took a short corner. Sending it in. Parker bounced it up and right into Joe Willis' hands. Good idea, good idea. So we just got red carded for what maybe should have been a yellow. That was uh, Lundquist. Lundquist got red carded. Wow, that's that's extreme. That's extreme, rough. He's actually going to VAR. It's the first time we've actually seen this. Let's see if he can rescind the red card. All right, he's going to VAR. Decision. God damn it! He's 
upholding the decision. the game with uh, one less player than the other team. We're down a man. We're down to nine. We're down to ten guys now. We're down to ten guys. Looks like they're making a change like Thor's going off. They're bringing in, they're bringing in Sebas already. That's what it looks like. It's hard to tell. Sam Junka. Sam Junka's coming in. He's uh, more of a defender. But can score, so. and Clark and our guys laying on the field this referee has completely lost his mind he's completely lost his mind this is junk this is garbage I want to stay positive in these videos but this referee he was doing fine now he, he's lost his damn mind he has lost his damn mind so Nashville have the ball and they're pressing again with an extra man, or rather we have one less man. I, I'm beside myself with this referee. It's gonna be a miracle if we if we win this after the shenanigans that have happened. So they added five minutes of uh, He should have got a red for that. He poked this in. He grabbed him like a bowling ball. He grabbed his face like a bowling ball. Why did you not give him a red? All right, it's halftime here in Houston. Dynamo are still up one to nothing. It's going to be a tough second half. Tough second half. Everyone is booing the referees. Yeah. All right, here we are in the second half. Dynamo have a chance outside of the uh, Nashville box. I didn't see what changes were made at the half. I'm not sure if there were. I'm, not, I'm looking at the field. I don't see any changes that were made at halftime. Oh. So they called the foul against Houston outside the box. Darwin Quintero was pissed, spiked the ball, and got a yellow card. So now Nashville has a shot outside the box on the other end of the field. This referee has lost his mind. Oh, I mean, to be fair, spiking the ball will get it. Oh, that was a crap shot. That was crappy. Spiking the ball, I can kind of see it, but he shouldn't have called the foul. He shouldn't have called the foul. Whatever. I love the girl. I love we had, we had a, we had a, Papa had a great chance. Great chance. He was the last 
He was the last defender. He should have. He should have got red carded. Everybody's, everybody's camping up to get this shot. Here we go. Here we go, Darwin. Versus our former keeper, Joe Willis. You got this. in a corner we're not too far in, we're not too deep into the second half here so there's still a lot of game left we really need to uh defend well defend well I feel a little bit better now that we do have two goals but it's still a lot of game left the crossbar Woo! so they took out Darwin Quintero who just scored and replaced him with Ethan Bartlow I got to meet him with Thor uh, at the last Dynamo Dos match he's another defender so we're definitely going heavy on the defense now oh Nashville is just kind of peppering at the goal there we go there we go Seren's got the ball. A few minutes ago, uh, Nashville brought in Walker Zimmerman. He's the uh, number 25. He's he's really good on the U.S. national team. Um, so for Nashville to have a U.S. national team star is, is kind of a big deal for them. The league's a little different than it was a few years back. Most of our players are in the European leagues now. So, but, ooh. Nashville, they keep going at it, but not connecting, not connecting, thankfully. All right, Dynamo just made three changes. So we've got some fresh legs for the end of this match here. We got Pash Money in the match. Tyler Pash Money. Let's make it happen, Pash Money. Beto Avila's in. His first match with the senior team. At least uh, an MLS match.
one jersey, number 69, you dirty bastard. <laughs> Six minutes of stoppage time. Come on. Six minutes. Jeez. Pasher, Pasher, wasting some time, wasting some time. That's all right. It's all right. Everybody's whistling. It's been it's been close to six minutes. Oh, here we go. Come on, Don Mo. Come on, blow the whistle. Blow the whistle. Blow the whistle, blow the whistle, blow the whistle, blow the whistle.
Monte on on a league night win. On a Saturday night league game win, I should say. We ain't going anywhere for a while. There you go. Somebody was asking for Albati on last time. There you go. It's Albati on. All right, so I'm walking the opposite direction. Try to go around. A little kid, he's just like, are you a YouTuber? I was like, he waved at me and I was like, hey, what's up? Hey, new Surge member right there. He waved at me and I was like, hey. And he's like, are you a YouTuber? I was like, yeah. He's like, yeah, I know. Little kids, little kids, awesome. So I, I really do need to try to keep this positive and kid friendly. <laughs> so 10th anniversary here at PNC Stadium. Dynamo are victorious. Even being down a man, one of the craziest games I've seen in a while. But they uh, they held it down for H Town. Held it down for H Town. Taking the long way around because there's no way I was gonna get through. El Batillon. So walking on the east side. Everyone's happy. Everyone's happy when your team wins. It's a great feeling great feeling. Here's the autograph alley. People lining up to get an autograph from uh, one of the players. Not exactly sure who. They might have announced it, but I didn't hear. All right, guys. I, I like doing it from this spot. You can see all the trophies that our team has gotten. I just took a picture with some uh, some young kids. Like I, like I was saying, I, I really want to be positive and uh, be child-friendly on these vlogs. So, all the parents that let their kids watch my videos, I appreciate you. You guys are cool. Um, I'm standing right in front of the water fountain. Look at some people. Get some water. Anyway, Dynamo win. A league win. They haven't done that in a while. Uh, they went down a man. It was high drama, but they pulled it together. Great coaching by Paulo Nagamura to manage the players. The, the Dynamo have a lot of games coming up in a short amount of time. So his ability to manage the players is going to be critical in this stretch. Um, they have a game again on Wednesday against Seattle, the CONCACAF champions. Uh, I will not be able to come to that game because this is a heavy metal travel show, right? So I'm going to go see Danzig on Wednesday. I'm so stoked. I love Danzig. He's one of my favorites. So unfortunately, I'm going to have to miss that match, but I'm going to make it up. I'm going to Kansas City. Thank you. I'm going to Kansas City for the next round of the U.S. Open Cup, the Sweet 16. I don't think you're allowed to call it the Sweet 16, but it's the round of 16. Houston Dynamo FC at Sporting Kansas City on Wednesday, May 25th. Not too many people from Houston are going to be able to go to that. Um, I looked at different options of how to get there. I'm just going to drive. So if you want to help me get there, Hit that super thanks. I've got links in the bottom to my Venmo, my PayPal, my Cash App. That would really help me to get there and come back. And I'm gonna bring you some great footage of some amazing places along the way. I've already got it on my mind, what I'm gonna see. that I didn't see in 2020 when I went in that general vicinity. So, uh, my goodness. So, uh, coming up. Um, Tomorrow there's a Dash pizza party. The Dash tied one to one with Racing Louisville, so I'm supposed to come down here for a Dash pizza party tomorrow. We'll see. Uh, we'll see how I'm feeling. Uh, on Monday, I will have Pillaging Villagers on the Most Metal Monday Night Live. Um, so we'll have that. That will be live at 7 p.m. on Monday. Um, there's something I'm working on for Tuesday. We'll see if that happens or not. Wednesday, I'm going to go see Danzig with Cradle of Filth. Um, Thursday, me and my mom are going to see the Houston Astros. It's Astro Star Wars Day. So me and my mom are going to that. And uh, yeah, we'll see what else is coming up. So if you don't want to miss anything, hit that notification bell. You can follow me on Twitter. I always post on Twitter when I uh, post a new video. And yeah, I guess that's it. Dynamo win! Yes, we got all three points. Until next time, remember to drink water. Yeah! Listen to metal, enjoy nature, and have the most epic adventure!